I'm going to start in a parallel ready stance. The left foot gathers back to neutral as the hands come up, and we'll make a left high side block. Uh, the thumb should be eyeball level. From here, we're going to relax and make the right reverse punch. And then the spot turn, the left foot steps slightly in, and the right foot steps back with a right high uh, uh, outer forearm block or high side block, and then the reverse punch. From here, number five move, the left foot comes up to the right foot as the hands come into neutral. Then the hands reach back into the intermediate position at 45 degree angle, hands are still closed, and left side forward L stance with the double knife hand block. Notice the uh, knife hand or the fingertips are level with the shoulder. All right, so that's number five move. On number six, we're gonna step forward with a, with a circular spear hand. So the hands come back, fingers up, and it is a circular move to go into the, uh, go into the, the flat fingertip thrust, the spear hand. That should be level with the shoulder as we step into that, that right side forward walking stance with the middle spear hand. All right, so the opening six moves are, are, are a left walking stance, to the left, outer forearm block, and reverse punch, spot turn with the outer forearm block, high side block, and the reverse punch, left foot comes up to the right foot, and the left foot steps out into an L stance with a knife hand guarding block, and we step forward into a walking stance with the uh, flat fingertip thrust. All right, so after the flat fingertip thrust, we have our, our, our wrist release and our spin back fist. So, from the uh, flat fingertip thrust, we are wrist release, and then the left foot spins around, we hesitate, slow down, and then step into the back fist high strike. That is a left front stance with the back fist high strike. And then I step forward with my right foot into a right side forward walking stance with a right uh, back fist high strike. Now from here, I'm gonna look over my right shoulder, and that's where the next target is, but I'm gonna get there by spinning around with my left leg or my back leg. So my left leg spins around 270 degrees into a walking stance. I'm left side forward in my walking stance. And we have the uh, outer forearm block or the high side block. And then relax and reverse punch. Then the spot turn, right side forward walking stance with the uh, outer forearm block or the high side block. And the relax and the reverse punch. From here, number 13 move, the left foot comes back to the right foot, and then at a 15 degree angle, I'm gonna step into a left side forward walking stance with the um, wedge block, with the high wedge block. That's a left front stance with a high wedge block. It's gonna be a right middle front kick, the right foot goes down to neutral, and then steps forward into a right side forward walking stance with a right front punch and reverse punch. This punch should be in fast motion. The right foot moves over 15 degrees to the other side with a high wedge block. Middle front kick. Left foot goes down to neutral and then steps forward with a front punch and then right reverse punch. From here, the left foot moves back over, going straight backwards now. Left side forward walking stance with a high rising block. Then the right foot, right hand, making the right side forward walking stance with the right high block. Now from here, I'm going to again look over my shoulder, over my right shoulder, and my left foot, my back foot is going to spin around 270 degrees into a sitting stance, and left, knife hand strike in a sitting stance. From there, my left foot goes to my right foot, and my right hand's going to be the hand closest to my body, and my right foot's going to circle out and around, right side steps out into the sitting stance with the right knife hand, and the right foot comes back to ready stance, and then the left foot comes back.